Welcome to Learning English with Captain Vinay Varagil, Assistant Professor, Department of English, Saint Joseph's College of Delhi, Kolkata, Kerala. We look at uh, the different aspects of fiction. Previous lectures we have studied epistolary novel, picarious novel, gothic novel, novel of manners, social novel, historical novel, and uh, realistic novels. So. all these lectures are meant for the undergraduate ba english main students of uh, the colleges of university of calicut and we are specializing in reading fiction and today we are going to discuss a different kind of novel which is known as regional novel the regional novels emphasizes the setting the speech and social structure and customs of a particular locality and uh, the very local color in these novels is very important novel is just consider a particular geographical locality as the background of their novels the flora and fauna the climatic changes the very special aspects of uh, the behavior customs and manners of the people all this is constituting the important aspect of the novels called the regional novels and these regional uh, novels the places the places can be realistic sometimes the places the novelist mention or uh, they just create in their novels can be a real place anywhere in the world or it could be an imaginary really fictitious world or place which you will not find in the map or atlas so the special features of the locality or the region affect the temperament of the characters and their ways of thinking feeling and interacting We have a number of regional novels written in world literature, Western literature, British literature, and Indian literature. And some of the best instances of regional novels are the novels of Thomas Hardy, the great British novelist, who has written novels like Under the Greenwood Tree, Tales of the Daredevils, Jude the Obscure, etc. So. His novels are set in a locality called Wessex, and we know that Thomas Hardy's novels are known as Wessex novels. Although his novels deal with fatalism, pessimism, etc., he is also known for the very regional novels he has created. Other uh, instances of uh, regional novels or novelists we have in. the uh, yeah william william faulkner the united states of american american novelist william faulkner is a regional novelist he has created the yokanaba chaffa county and the mississippi mississippi is often the very setting and locale of the novels of uh, william faulkner similarly we have uh, the indian novelist ark narayan and ark narayan he has created a, a region for his novels most of the novels like the guide wender of swifts bachelor of arts swami and friends all these novels of arkan narayan are set in a particular place a region a locale called malguri and he is known as the novelist of malguri and if we look for the place in Uh, the atlas or map you won't find the place called malguri but when we read the novels we understand that these novels are about a place in india it's it's in fact this particular place called malguri has a lot of aspects of uh, indian uh, states maybe okay these places are the places we see in the south indian states of kerala karnataka tamil nadu or andhra and we are 
not uh, sure whether it is in Tamil, Th Tamil Nadu or Karnataka or Andhra or Kerala because the very climate, uh, the very flora and fauna and all the very mannerisms and appearance of the characters are that of uh, the people in South India. And uh, this is a very, very special world created by Arkanarayan for his characters to roam around, to live and to, of course, to interact with each other. So, regional novels are novels which are emphasizing the very background, the setting and uh, the very loca location or the geographic geography is affecting the speech, the manners, the social structure, etc. of the very, very characters of the novel. This is all you have to remember about regional novels and uh, in the subsequent uh, lectures we are looking at uh, Hardy's novels, Thomas Hardy as a novelist and uh, the very basic or fundamental aspects of the novels of Thomas Hardy. So we shall be having two different lectures, one on Hardy's life and the other on the features of uh, the novels of Thomas Hardy. Thank you very much for listening. May God bless you. Oh, 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 oh,